of six to start the year. There were questions about this. Women of Troy volleyball team, no longer. After taking care of Oregon State in three straight, they have now won seven in a row and are unbeaten in conference play. They got a lot of weapons. Kalia Williams, who graduated from Washington State last May, but still has a lot of volleyball in her. Another big day, 11 kills on 16 total attacks, only two errors, hit 562. She was the key early on. They were from pin to pin and ran her on the X as well. But of course the day and the year will belong to Skylar Fields. She is number one in the conference and number two in the country in kills. And today she was just simply unstoppable and unrelenting. 18 kills, 31 total attacks. She had a ridiculous 581. That's 581 against a defense that spent the last three days figuring out how to stop her. London Weejay, the freshman of the week in the Pac-12, and the new phenom for SC, finished with nine kills and hit 571. For Oregon State, seven kills for Peyton Seuss, and Megan Sheridan came on late with six as well. SC hitting 478 for the match as a team. They hit 679, 500, and 294. For Oregon State, they just couldn't get going. They had a nice run to start that second set, but could not sustain it. And it's just too much women of Troy. So for the head coach, Brad Keller, his team has now won seven in a row, and that reaches the high water mark in the Keller era here at the Galen Center. SC wins it in three. For everyone here at the Pac-12 Network, I'm Jim Watson. So long from downtown LA.